Japan's nuclear regulator has ordered the operator of Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant to remove radioactive wastewater from underground tunnels. High levels of radioactivity have been detected in wells at the site and an adjacent port since May. The utility admitted last week that contaminated water from the facility is leaking into the sea. Pounder in the sink and just slowly pour the water into it. The Nuclear Regulation Authority also told Tokyo Electric Power Company that highly radioactive wastewater in the plant's underground tunnels could seep through gravel beneath one of them. The contaminated water is believed to be coming from turbine buildings connected to the tunnels. The structures are highly contaminated as large amounts of water have been used to cool nuclear fuel in nearby reactor buildings. Tokyo Electric says it will start injecting chemicals into the gravel to block the water it says it will decontaminate the water by circulating it through a purifier from September and drain the tunnels from next April. あの、原発以外にもお聞きしたいんですけども、原発の件で一つ言っとくと、私はあの、北千住で最後の日に演説されたの聞きに行かせていただいたんですけども、山本さんおっしゃる中で一つやっぱり気になったのは今おっしゃ
think funny things. Another claim of data manipulation has emerged for a drug maker, Novaltis, in Japan. A clinical study on their blood pressure drug is being challenged. GKA University Medical School announced the results of its probe into Novaltis Pharma's drug, Diovan. The investigation panel says the study contains data on blood pressure that does not match the original clinical records. The panel believes the data was not altered by the school's researchers. It says the study was carried out by a former official of Novaltis Pharma. But the panel criticizes the researchers, saying they falsely reported the pharmaceutical company did not participate in the study. The former company official was involved in Diovan clinical tests at a number of medical schools. Earlier this month, Kyoto Prefectural University of Medicine said its clinical study may have wrongly concluded that the drug is more effective than other medications in reducing brain strokes and angina. Novaltis Pharma used the results of the clinical study to promote Diavan. Annual sales of the drug in Japan were worth about $1 billion. A month's worth of rain fell in some parts of western Japan on Sunday. The downpour led to flooding and landslides. It killed one person, with at least three others still missing. The deluge saw more than 100 millimeters of rain per hour fall on parts of Yamaguchi and Shimane prefectures. A 79-year-old woman died when her home collapsed. More than 200 millimeters of rain lashed the coastal region to the north of the two prefectures in 24 hours. The water level of rivers has been rising in Ishikawa Prefecture, and there is danger of flooding. Residents in parts of the northern island of Hokkaido have also seen heavy rains. What's the worst that could happen? When you get out there and try that song 
I'm going to be out of internet range. <laughs>